guys welcome to my channel it is Jalen um, thank you so much for clicking on this video <clears throat> so today I am super excited to show you all what I got my kid for Christmas I've been binge watching these videos since this past October and every year around the same time um, but I'm super excited that this year my son was old enough to actually participate um, he was excited um, and yeah, so I'm in my pajamas because we actually just celebrated Christmas today because unfortunately I have to work this weekend for Christmas on Christmas Day. So, um, this morning, yesterday, what's today's date? Today is the 21st, December 21st, 2022, and today is our Christmas Day. It is around 9 a.m., so that just shows you that we've been through all the motions, all the things this morning. Um, but he had an amazing Christmas as far as gift giving. The day is still going to continue. I just really wanted to shoot this. I, this is a lot of memories. Um, I actually recorded it on my end for me just to be able to watch. Looking forward to looking back at that. But anywho, um, yeah, it's a lot for um, about my kids. So I only have one child. His name is Cohen. I'm in his room right now. Um, Cohen, he just turned two October 28th this year, and yeah, Cohen is, um, pretty much advanced two-year-old. He loves trucks. He loves trains. He loves dinos, cocoa melon. Um, I know him, but it's just a lot. But that, uh, those four things are kind of where we are getting at this year for Christmas, as well as learning toys, educational toys. He's advancing up in school, and I need him to be able to identify his colors before he goes to the next class, and et cetera, et cetera. Without further ado, let's get started. <clears throat> all right, so um, the first thing I'm going to show you all are shoes. Disclaimer, I am not going to show clothes. As you can see, I'm in his room, and behind me, his bed is filled with clothes i'm not going through every single one of them but he has clothes enough clothes for the gear no more clothes um but let's go into shoes so the first pair of shoes we got my guy got him some forces you know super cute simple to the point um i feel like everybody needs a basic white shoe and i just made him like a public uh instagram account and it goes really cute with all his outfits um so and my son, he clearly opened his shoes. <laughs> All the things are here. Uh, the next one he got are these. Love these shoes. Oh, they are so cute. And he has a lot of black and red items. And that's like what we wear a lot. Um, but these are, let me read it so I don't butcher the name. These are Jordan 1 mid. Yeah, 1 mid. <laughs> Um, but I got these in a size 8C. Right now he's in a comfortable 7. Um, and the forces were in a C as well. But right now he is in a 7. But depending on the shoe, he does wear 8. So the next shoe I have are these Vans. And these are the colorful Vans. Honestly, not gonna lie, I really didn't like these. Um, I did not. His dad really wanted him to have them. So that's why we have it. We also got these pants. And then the next one, um, I love these from Target. Cat and Jack, their brand. It's like the details for me. They have the stitching on them on the side. They are so cute. And then we're living in Kansas right now, and it's getting very cold, and um, he needs some shoes that can sustain this weather for sure. For sure. And then the last pair of shoes that we have are these Hirachis. Look at the baby Hirachis. Oh my goodness. Cannot take it. But yeah, these are also in the AC. All right, let's get into the good stuff. So um, how we do it in our house this year, we're still new to this, so we're trying to figure it out. But for the most part, everything that was unopened um, and everything you could just see, that was from Santa. So, from Santa, which is not going to be posted in this video, he had a kitchen set. Um, I'll drop the link in the description box. He had a kitchen set, a grocery set, a shopping cart, which was bought from Sam's. It was like a realistic shopping cart. And um, this piano. I do have this right here. This piano. 
piano was really from mommy and daddy, but we couldn't wrap it, so it was from Santa. So he really enjoyed looking at these um, items. Uh, but yeah, what really caught his attention though is this train set. Oh, it's so it's so much going on up in here, up in here, up in here. So. Yeah. He was really excited about this, and usually everyone um, posts puts these around their um, Christmas tree. Our tree was kind of it's in an awkward spot, and it wasn't enough space to do that, so I just left it in the box, and I wanted to see like how he would react, and if he was very eager, I would like wouldn't mind opening it, but he didn't let me have to open it. So yeah, next year it will be around the tree. <laughs> But um, he's obsessed with trains and just the fact that this is so real for him and it has his own track and it blows smoke and steam. He's going to really enjoy this when we open it, when we finally get to open it. Alright, um, I guess the next thing, um, he got this easel. This was from um, a friend of mine. She got this for him. He's really going to enjoy this. It says for ages 3 plus, it's Melissa and Doug wooden tabletop easel. Um, this is very convenient for his little toddler table chair set. He can, after he eat a snack or during um, busy time, what we call busy time, he can get on here, color. I don't have to worry about it being on my furniture. And I love it. And there's three ways to use it, too. I love um, items or toys that can are multifunctional. Uh, the next thing is something I was really excited to get him, and he actually really enjoyed it when he opened it. And this are a set of three pull and go mini planes. It has sound effects, and it's friction powered, so you pull it and it just takes off. So my son, he loves planes, and I cannot wait until he uh, we actually start playing with this. And I actually bought this off Amazon, and I will link everything that I bought off Amazon in the description below. Um, let's get into some educational stuff I mean although I'm going like all over the place um, but I really enjoy learning resources between learning resources and Melissa and Doug only because of their fictional um, pretend play um, but fix it so it has a hammer you have an axe you have um, a wrench it just gives him um, some realistic tool sets that he can use and yeah I thought I saw this and I was just like and it's for ages two and up um but I saw this and I was like he has to have that um he can even fix his kitchen if he needs to <laughs> yeah I thought that was super cute and the next minor resources thing we have is uh, farmer's market coloring color sorting set this was very important to me because like I said when he goes up to a new classroom he is going to have to know how to identify his colors and right now that's something we are avidly working on um, and hopefully this set helps us with that process a little bit more um, and most of these gifts so far I think I've identified what we bought and what our family or friends bought um, <clears throat> but yeah if you yeah, if that matters um, the next thing is from his second grandmother. Of course, it's out of the box, but this is a laptop. Hi, I'm Scout. Okay, Scout. Okay. Press a letter button. But yeah, I'm going to turn this off for now. But it's a two-in-one leap top touch. And I think it's so cool because you can also flip it like this. And it's like a tablet. And then flip it over and then you have a laptop. So from what we played with this morning... You tap it, it says the letter, so JJ um, says it out loud. You can go over to messages, games, music. But yeah, this tablet is super cute, and I feel like he is going to get a lot of use out of it. And it is definitely something that can grow with him as he gets older, because like I said, he did just turn two. So yeah, I love that. And the next thing was a gift from our um, my friend. She gave him his first Lego set and I'm never gonna buy him Legos <laughs> I don't think I will until unless he tells me he wants some of course but um I just thought this was pretty neat because every video I've watched this for 
um, all the mommies, boy moms out there, they've been having to buy Legos, and I'm just like, oh, I missed out on that. Um, but I think it's cool that Cohen has his first one, and it's a cement mixer truck, and he loves any and all transportation and vehicles. So um, this is right up his alley. Um, I'm excited to play this with him. The next thing I got, I believe I got this from Five Below, um, a Coco Melon puzzle. Self-explanatory, but he loves puzzles and books. <clears throat> he loves puzzles, he loves books, and I'm excited to do this puzzle with him. It's a little bit more advanced, but we're going to do it together. Um, since we're into Coco Melon right now, let's go to this. I'm not sure where I got this, but I'm assuming um, Five Below as well, or maybe Dollar General or something like that but i shop everywhere ross everywhere you can think of um yeah it has a mat on the back some of our wrapping paper is still on it <laughs> but it has this little mat and he can drive on a city map like i thought that was just so neat um but he's gonna love this and then oh i think i'm gonna stick the cocoa melon all right the next thing we have is this musical doctor checkup set. The son is he thinks he's my doctor. Um he loves to check get his temperature checked. He knows how to do it. And I think this will be like a perfect tool to be able to get him to be more imaginative. 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 <laughs> but um super excited about this and it's something I feel like you can put all of these items into this and carry it along with us which makes it a lot of fun i love travel toys um i don't see any more cocoa melon items right now so now i'm gonna go to the puzzles um i got a lot of puzzles um so the first one i'm gonna listen to farm animals we love these we go through all the sounds of the animals and um he knows how to identify where they go to um then we have the sea animals this will be pretty new to us he hasn't he's only been exposed to like a few of these like the whale the shark um but octopus and um crab and sea star we're gonna well he knows about the sea star but we're gonna see about the other two and then this last melissa and doug puzzle we have wooden jigsaw puzzle and um this is just like a more complex one um it says three plus but we have a couple like this and he does great so super excited about the puzzles he didn't really want to open those this morning <laughs> he was so into the kitchen set um so this next one i'm like definitely skipping times but i got this uh, i got this from i want to say i got this from ross but it's the kids book preschool edition um the big book of learning fun and so many activities in here um Although right now he probably won't understand most of it, um, when he's ready, we'll have it. So I love this. It has a lot of activities. Um, yeah. So the next one is a story, Disney stories for three-year-olds. I thought this was magical because we love reading to each other. Although he's not quite three, he's going to be soon. Um, but yeah, we read every night and this is so convenient because we can just flip and go to another Disney story. So I love that. And then while we're on books, we got we're going on a Santa hunt. I love this one because of all the representation up in here. I loved it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Um, since uh, Christmas actually hasn't even passed yet, we're definitely going to keep reading this. We'll start reading this up until the day. Super excited to read this book. Um, so he did get some toys that are not age appropriate yet. And I'm going to go ahead and show those for those who have older kids. So this first one, I think I was more excited about this um, than he was. But it's a Black Panther um, RC race car or just race car. Um, it says ages 8 plus. It's high speed, 32 feet control distance, which is like, that seems like a lot. Um, and full function. It has a remote um, that you can control the car with. Um, I just love this. I just recently went to go see the new one, and I've just been ah, obsessed. <laughs> but um, he loves cars. He loves trucks, and he knows how to use them. But um, 
when it's time, we're going to wait and see how he like feels and how he actually can handle it. So we'll have that. And this came from a friend of mine. Thank you, Kaylin. Um, the next one uh, is ages eight plus as well. And it's a remote control robot T-Rex. Um, he loves dinos. So the T-Rex was a hit this morning. He liked, he enjoyed it. Um, but we just got to see again if he can handle it. But this seems pretty cool. It's a walking dinosaur and it roars with the touch of a button. So super excited to see him interact with this dino. And this came from my aunt and my cousin. This is a three, it's more age appropriate, but it's a three plus um, mega robot. So it's motorized walking, it lights up and sounds, and it has adjustable arms. So it's multifunctional, and I'm super excited. When he opened this, we pressed the button. I'm going to actually press it for y'all. His face was like... Okay. He's very long-winded, I'll say that. <laughs> But yeah, he was a little scared. Um, it does need three AA batteries. Um, it says it's not included, but I guess they have some in. Um, but super excited to play with him. This, um, the next thing we have, I told y'all he loves trucks. He actually picked this up from um, Walmart himself. So we went to return a gift, and we went to return a gift because he had already had the item that we were returning so they gave us a little gift card so let's go replace it so we're going down the aisle he sees this in the middle of the aisle he grabs it and walks towards the door i'm like okay simple you made it easy for me <laughs> so um yeah he loves this little truck um uh, it's a ram 1500 and um, four wheel drive like it seems pretty cool i think cohen is definitely going to be a truck boy when he gets older <laughs> Um, yeah, and we got that from Walmart. And the next one, I definitely got this from Dollar General because I've been going there recently. And they had a lot of good toys for his age. And I know I used to love Cookie Monster. He doesn't really know too much about them, but. <laughs> yeah, um, I'm super excited for him to play with this. It says. Um, Press Cookie Monster's belly to activate silly phrases and a song. Um, they also have Elmo here too, but I'm pretty sure everybody's singing Cookie Monster. Um, so next thing, we haven't really dived into Play-Doh too much, but he does have some. He got some in his stocking, uh, which I haven't shown. Um, but he had a Play-Doh set right here, and this is just, um, it's a starter set, and it has the scissors. Um, you make shapes out of it. Pretty simple. And he also has a dino. What is this? It's like a dino. Mini T-Rex, mini dino. Um, Play-Doh kit that he can play with. It. So, yeah. Here's his Play-Doh. Um, the next thing. Uh, he also got another cash register. And this is just going to go to his dad's house since we're co-parenting. He's going to go take this there because his um, groceries, the grocery set, the grocery mart that he has um, also comes with it. So definitely don't need two lying around here. So that's going to go to his dad's house. But he really enjoyed that. Um, this next one is also, um, I think it's for older kids. It's definitely, it's giving me... Oh yeah, it says age is 8 plus, but it is a Dino Fossil Dig Kit, um, National Ge Geographic brand, and um, I'm excited about this, I'm so excited. Um, I think he's going to definitely love it, and um, I feel like as long as we're doing it together, it should be fine, um, but it says unearth a replica T-Rex tooth, so that's exciting. It has little tools, a magnifying glass, and a brush, it comes with a lot. Super excited to try this out. Um, we may have to hold on to it depending on the complexity of it, but we'll see. Um, we're getting down to the last few things. This video is very long. The sun was very blessed this year. So, 
The next thing, he got a fire truck puzzle from Ross. It was $6.99, and that came from my aunt and my cousin as well. He loves fire trucks, and he loves puzzles, so this was perfect, right up his alley. Um, this next thing, obviously, I told y'all we did Christmas early um, today, so a lot of these things are not are already unwrapped. But this is the Melissa and Doug train set, portable train set. I absolutely love it. Um, I can't wait to play with this on um, when I finish this. I think this is what we're going to be doing. But it comes, I don't want to open it, but it comes with um, like a house, uh, deers, and obviously trains and cars that you can put on it as well. This one, I just went for it. I was ready. Um, when I felt that I was having a boy, I was excited because I can't wait to do um, have nerf fights, nerf wars. Um, but this is obviously not a nerf. And this is a two-pack. We can do it together. And this came from Dollar General for, I believe, like $5. Um, he's going to have to grow in. Oh, yeah, six plus. If he doesn't get it now, we can just save it for later. But I was excited. <laughs> this next thing came from Coach Gigi. And this is a... Um, I don't want to press all these buttons because I feel like they talk for so long. But it is a VTech microphone karaoke microphone from two to five years of age so this is perfect for him and um these days cohen is singing bye bye black sheep like it's nobody's business so bye bye black sheep and twinkle twinkle little star he just breaks out in song and i love it he has the sweetest voice ever so cute um the next thing this was definitely from dollar general as well um it has a knife and some fruit I think this is going to be perfect for his little kitchen. He can cut up on the counter, you know, do all the good things he needs to do. And, yeah, I think this is just something fun to have. Fun for him to have. Um, we got Blippi. We're getting into Blippi and Mika. We love them a lot. And Blippi talks to us. So he interacted with him a lot this morning. And that was, like, really nice to see because I don't know what this is. Um, but it was really nice to see, so I'm excited that he likes it. He likes his Blippi, and he's not, it's not, everything isn't Coco Melon this year, so that's mostly what I'm excited for. Um, the last couple of things, uh, we have this fire truck, and this is also a, it has a remote control, and it's battery operated. i super excited about this. My son loves fire trucks. And this came from um, one of my aunts. Oh, no. I'm having a breach now. This is something I wanted to get my baby because he, it sounds pretty gross, but Cohen always has his hands in my mouth. <laughs> so now he can do it um, a different way. And um, also learn the anatomy of the teeth and um, some of the toys vibrate. I just thought this was super cool and it's realistic so it's not just something some play play like BS toy it's something you can actually grow with too um but yeah I'm definitely gonna keep this for a while <laughs> um I showed you all the piano um next we got this deluxe 50 piece wood train set <laughs> this is pretty cool we love the wood wooden toys um, but if you all haven't told, like, couldn't tell by now, Cohen has, like, three trains, so trains are really big up in this household. But, yes! So, this concludes my video. Thank you all so much for watching. Please consider liking, commenting, and subscribing to my channel if you like what I, what you see. Um, yeah, thank you so much. My name is Jalen. Hope you all have a merry, merry Christmas. Um, celebrate love on your family while you can because you know some people like me have to hold it down at work well you know you know how it goes but I'm so excited I, I had the the opportunity to share this day with my son and my family today and thank you all for watching <laughs>